What's up everybody? Welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority. Once again with Danny Sorody, how to park it up and we're gonna put to the test burger gadgets. Oh, it's gonna be a good one. Oh, you're gonna be hungry after this. Let's go. For the first gadget we got here, mini stuffer, a Sinan TV, slider burgers, whatever, same thing, all right? It looks so good. Let's put it to the test. I guess we're just gonna go up grind beef and not put it all the way because we wanna, what do you call it, stuff them. Stuff. So you don't wanna overfill it, I guess, right? Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, so let's figure this out. Hopefully that's not a lot, but it will press anyway. So you lock it right here, that's interesting. And then you turn and push. That's cool. So you're making a pocket. Yeah, inside of it. Well, it looks like, oh my gosh. Oh, I forgot to pull them out. Okay. Whoa, that's cool. All right, and then we're gonna put some cheese in there with help of Dennis. You know what, more cheese, I love cheese. It's gonna get melted, there will be almost nothing. Yeah, more, we can stuff it. Yeah, cheesy, cheesy burgers. Who does not like cheese and burgers? That way you don't even have to put uh, cheese on top. It's all inside, make it really, really juicy. I'm getting hungry, dude. I know, that looks delicious, don't it? So I guess I'll just put a little bit of meat here and then it will press it. So I guess we'll close it and turn this back, okay? And then lock it and then push them all of them. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah, so that way it doesn't make a pop kit anymore. It makes little slider burger things. So let's open it. Oh, this one come up, got stuck. It's okay. Almost, I think it looks good. Let's dab it on a grill and see what happens. Maybe fix it up. Looks good, but you know the coolest part is to take it out. Oh, you just, ooh, that's delicious. the best way. I was wondering how you could take it out, dude. Yeah, easy. Came out nice. Yeah. And then this comes off, stop it on the oh, grill. that's great. Okay, and then we just stick it on the grill. Boom. I hope this doesn't fall out, we'll see. That's why we're testing it. While this cooking, we're gonna put to the test another gadget. I don't know that cat, it's way out there. I don't know what that <laughs> noise, but sounds like cats fighting. Never mind that noise, it's not mine. But anyways, let's do some burgers. And the dogs are in the back, so it's not the dogs either. either yeah. <laughs> you got the burger shaper, you just peel it open. This is like a little silicone plastic feel. Looks pretty cool. I'm just gonna pop in some ground beef right there. Put the whole stock in there. Do you think it'll be maybe All too much? Yeah, that's more. More? Okay. Yeah. Russians like big burgers. Yeah, you can I guess you can just like up put it all, all like yeah. this. Oh, and it's it? just gonna cut it out itself. Yeah, oh, so that's cool. keep filling it right here too. And that way it will press it so it'll be thick too. A thick, yeah, good. Burger. More for sure. Fill it up. Yeah. I got tons of beef right now. Now you don't even have to use hands. This you is can cool. Use this. You just kind of like pop it in. Wow, look at that. So there you go. the patties are in. Oh, yeah, that's it. Wow, looks good. Look at that. These burgers look amazing. Now pop it with this thing. Let's see if it works. That looks delicious. This is the best freaking Whoa, burger. That's awesome. Put some over here. Try to take them all out. This is a good way to prep a burger. Wow, look at that. Instead and of you like have rounding them out. Beautiful burgers. You got too. nice ones. This one I kind of peeled off. You can even messy. use a knife to cut them up. Oh, yeah, this is delicious. But they fall off pretty good, too. I love it. Wow. I definitely use this gadget. What do you think, Dennis? I would use it because I like big, thick, juicy burgers. Look at this thing here. Nice, thick, evenly spread, so it should cook nice and fresh and evenly. It's not gonna have like one big juice pocket. How do you usually prepare meatballs like that for the burgers? Meatballs or meat? I, like for the burger, do you just stuff it with your hands? So what I do is I'll take it like this. Yeah, that's so ugly. That's I know, and I'll smash so it. Much here's the problem. Better. So here's much the problem better. with that, especially if you like got stuff inside for seasoning and all that crap. When I still like this, it's just like a big juicy burger, but what happens is the middle's thicker than the outside. Oh, it might fall off. It doesn't yeah. cook well. It shrinks up and shrivels and it turns into like a little ball. That's true. This is evenly thickness. That's what I'm saying. I love it. Oh, those ones are about to ready to be flipped. Let's put these guys. Beautiful. One, two, 
Three, really one more? No, that's enough. Have any of you ever used a burger gadget before or a burger tool? I never did. I've used I've used the shaper no way. called hand. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> Anyways, I got another gadget card here. Burger shaper. There's four step instruction. Really, really easy. Let's figure out how it's used. Check this out. It opens like this. So if it's a little bit bigger and then you can close it and cut the access off. So you like go like that, boom, whatever extra, put it away. Oh, I think the closing part, it opens and falls oh, out. Nice. That's cool. I that's like, like it. That's like a perfect, that's like a McDonald burger right there. Yeah, look at that. Oh, that's cute. All right, now. Let's open that it. That looks like Boom. a good burger. Beautiful. Patty. Wow. And look how small it is. This ones are so big. The buns, I don't know, might be too big for this the buns. This is actually really good burger patty. Sauce. Perfect for the bun. And we'll, well test this, this out. Oh, we gotta flip this ones. Oh, look at that. Hopefully cheese don't fall oh out whenever I flip. <laughs> Woo! This burger gadget is another stuffer shaper. It's not a mini slider shaper. This is like a regular big burger shaper. Yeah, this is a big thick burger right here. Look at this guy. Holy cow. I guess it's the same. Exactly the same. Same but... concept. You got the levers to push in for the stuffer to make your pocket and then you smash it down again to seal the ingredients. So it's exact same company as Cine TV, but just bigger. bigger. Mm, bigger, better. So, we'll just Put that in there. That's enough for now. That's Actually, perfect. too much. Actually, it's good. You now you can make a pocket. Yeah. And now I want to make a little pocket for it. Seal it with the latch. Yeah, it's already good. Boom. Okay. And then I'm gonna turn it and push it down for the pocket. All right, that the should be a test. good. This should make a good pocket. This is making me so hungry. All right. That's good. That's good. You gonna stuff it in there. So. Yep. I want to put some habanero peppers in this one. Of course, add that cheese in there. We need to put a roof on it, right? Close it up. Oh, you have too much excess. You want ham. I want ham. Let's cut it out, some of that. Oh yeah, cut off some of the extra. Oh, just use the hands. Easy. It's Five. gonna be a big Big burger. burger for a big boy. Okay. So guys, if you're gonna do this, don't make too much burger either. Make it much less meat in the beginning. Yeah, we gotta redo it. All right, I open this bad boy up. Ooh, Ooh. And then nice. the best part, my favorite, is how do you get this out on the bottom? You just push it. Boom. And Easy. it's like a perfect burger. Use wow. this. Yeah, spatula. To take it out. Great idea. Just slide two, there you go. Wow. That burger is stuffed. Who wants a bite? Let's cook it first. Oh. Find, a, find a home for this big boy. Yeah. Holy cow, that looks pretty Film delicious. That. All right, let's flip this cheese out. Ooh. That looks great. Cheese come out a little bit. The cheese acts like glue. Ooh. Yeah. Wow. Dang, those turned out really I good. I think they're done. Maybe a little bit longer, just in case. Those three turned out What about really these good. ones? Ooh. They held together pretty well. Yeah. I feel like better than that party. They do shrink, yeah, but that body is not. Yeah, See, it's I all know. juice. Yeah, I like this one. These so ones are better. cooking evenly. Oh, that's a good one too, though. Ooh, that one looks way better than this one, this one, or that one. Yeah, it looks good. This one's kind of chunky, broken up. This one's the most beautiful out of these four. This is a mini burger press and mini burger grill holder. This is two gadgets have to be together. How cool is that? That looks awesome. So let's press it first. Wow, this is definitely a mini ones. Like little balls into here. Let's see what happens. Oh, this is so easy and fun. Nice. I yes. like it. So okay. this is just a shaper, right? Oh, yeah, just that. a shaper. Again, I probably have put too much meat in there, but you can take off access. I wonder how you pull that one out. Yeah, this one is not as fun because it's hard to pull it out. Maybe That's for it? sure. Yeah, how do you pull it out? Yeah, maybe you like have to... There you go. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Not the most efficient and pretty way to do it, but so far I like it. Let's see. 
that looks good. Ooh, they actually turn out really, really well. Wow, these two gadgets go together. I wonder if it's the same company makes them. You oh, press them, so good. and then they perfectly fit in there. How satisfying is this? This might be the best one. This two, you mean? Like for the shaper. Yeah, shaper and this because they fit together. They, yeah. they go together. I like the stuffer because I like to stuff it. Yeah. But this one is just so but unique. In terms of shaping and my cooking, this one might be the best. Yeah, how cool is that? I, this is might be a thumbnail. I don't even know. So many good gadgets. Okay, you close this. Boom. We're going to take them out. Those looks awesome. Cannot wait to maybe cut into it or bite into it. Oh, yeah. Ooh, oh, look at that, that cheese. You could even do more cheese. That looks delicious. I'm gonna taste it. Taste test. Ooh, that cheese pool. How is that? That's good. Mmm, wow. That is good. One of a kind for sure. Okay, we're gonna put it in here. And then whenever you close it, boom, it's gonna stick out a little bit, but it's not a big deal. This is the grill press. It's a burger press. So if you have a burger that's kind of loose, it's not working with you, it's not cooperating, let's just press it down. Oh, all right, get the grease going. There you go. You can just leave it there. It will cook faster too. Oh yeah, you're right. I think that's what it's for too. Boom. Boom. Oh, Close it. you're right. Boom. That's an easy one. Oh, and it's just like, this is hot too, so it's gonna cook both sides because it's yep. gonna get really hot. Fast. That's a really good idea. Okay, for this gadget, this is a square burger maker shaper. Let's open it up and let's see how it works. Wendy burgers. This is why I call them Wendy burgers? They're squares. Oh yeah, Wendy's have squ square burgers? Yeah, man. Put all of them in there. Mm -hmm. Okay, right. let's close it up, see what happens. So you can actually put those in the freezer, right? Uh, yeah, I think you can chill them and freeze them and reshape them. You know what? I need more meat. That's a good idea. This is fun. It's so soft. Okay, and then you open it like that. Let's see what happens. Ooh, look at that. They're already shaped. Wow. I, I think we used the, the other one on. Dude, that's like a professional... Wendy's burger. <laughs> Wendy's burger, exactly. Wow, wow. look at that. Drop it on the grill. You know, if you have that paper, you can stack them on top and stuff. Oh, that the wax good. paper. All right, let's put a couple on the grill, see what it looks like. I can just bring the whole tray in. Let's slap it. They hold up so well. I honestly like this better than that hexagon one. Yeah, the hexagon one was not good, but I may have packed it wrong too, though. Yeah, maybe we have messed it up. We don't know how to use it. This is the hexagon. But we'll see what happened to the square one after they cook. There's a lot of beef on this grill. I like it. And of course, you gotta get some good stuff, right, Dennis? Oh, yeah, man. Some Ooh, classic. this is how I love my burgers right there with all the vegetables. You want some cheese on it? Of course. All right, man. The square burger looks good. I like that. It looks pretty nice. The cheese is melting out of it a little bit. Let's yeah, ooh, yeah, I like it when it's cooked really oh. well. All right, let's squeeze some of the juices out of this guy. Woo! That's fun. All right, take it out. Yeah, it burst it a lot. Yeah. Now it's gonna cook all the way. That's how easy it is to flip them, and they're almost like done, these. too. Easy. Good. That looks good for you? Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Nice. That's your handmade. And this one, your stuff. The stuffed. Ooh. Oh my Cheesy. Gosh. Cheesy. <laughs> we put these oh, in? this one's are done too. Yeah, looks delicious. Done. Flip it for fun. Let's see what it looks like. Wow. That those looks look nice. Especially over there on the side. Maybe a little longer. Well, guys, we are done. Look at this burgers. Oh, Taste which, test. Let's put it up, see which one they want to take a bite of. Oh, that looks good, doesn't it? Well guys, subscribe to Denis Sorodi. Subscribe to Crazy Russian Hacker again. Mm. Thank you for watching. Let us know in comments below which gadget was your favorite. Hashtag get Crazy Russian Hacker to 11 million subscribers. Oh yeah, almost. This bite's for you. Mmm. That's good. Mm. Hot. Yeah. Mm. I Spicy. Spicy habanero peppers. Hot.
cool, it's a big bath. Mmm, I see the cheese. Mmm, looks delicious. Awesome.